Almost 180 innocent Israeli civilians have been murdered by terrorists who were freed from Israeli jails since the year 2000. The history shows us that when you release terrorists, you're creating more terror action in the region. 180 Israelis were murdered by terrorists who have been released before. That's only in the last six years. We know hundreds and hundreds who were murdered from their previous deal with uh, Jibril. Even with this fact known, the media aids these Arab terrorist groups by covering the anguish of the families of kidnapped soldiers. The entire country feels the unbearable sadness of these families and are convinced to release terrorists who are waiting to murder again. I'm just thinking for tomorrow. Yeah, and I'm thinking about tomorrow, what's happened for me tomorrow, and what is going to happen with to us. I'm not thinking two weeks from today. But isn't it the job of the government to think about what's going to happen two weeks a day, a month from now, a year from now? What's the, what's I'm, the, not, I'm not in the government, but I'm not in the government. I'm just his wife. Because the government is not considering the dangers of releasing murderers, the organization Almagor needs to be running public campaigns so the voices of the family's victims will be heard. I'm brother of Eliyahu Shacha, the one that was killed uh, by Samir Kunta. Uh, the government wants to release him, and I'm against that. I will suffer all my life because, because of him. My mother was dying eight months after my brother because she was crying all the time. Now I'm without my brother, without my mother, and this one is going home. Almagor, an organization of terror victims, is combating this dangerous trend of releasing terrorists. The media is willing to cover their case against releasing these dangerous criminals as long as it is presented. The success of this work gives the families of terror victims comfort in knowing that these murderers are still behind bars. It discourages the kidnapping of Israeli soldiers and simply saves Israeli lives. Please join us in this effort.